Hey guys, say it with Vintage Bruno. Now that's a sexy Megazord. That's a sexy Megazord. Got smaller though. <laughs> These are model kits. A lot of assembly is required. Let's start with a quick animation. I too can form a great power. Dark Wild Swords. Combine. Predazord. Awaken. Zanaku as a Megazord? But how? I don't know. This isn't good. We've got to find a way to stop him. Crescent Blade, Boomerang! Ah! Hang on! You're finished, Rangers! As much as I love the original Gal Ranger line, I always wished that it could do that. And this line does. So now you can have the head do the predator wave. There's also a clip for his staff. I think these look fantastic. Needless to say, a lot more articulation than the original line. These two have something in common. Can anyone tell me what it is? I need my blue elephant. Here's Hasbro's Mighty Morphin Megazord in the middle. They're about the same size. I also just put Gal Knight together. So this is mostly like buying Gal King, but with a red gorilla. We do get one entirely new mold. It's the Elephant Sword, or Gal Elephant, with trunk articulation. Isn't that cool? And they also give you a longer alternate trunk sword thingy. <laughs> That's a pretty cool looking thing. Gal Knight did appear in Gal Ranger, but never in Power Rangers Wild Force. But we did get a toy. We got the Ultimate Megazord, which had the Soul Bird and the Red Gorilla, but only in toy form in the US. It, it should be the Blue Elephant. The Black is a toy exclusive. I think we will get a blue elephant. They have the mold, they just have to change the color. I, I'm not gonna say guaranteed, but I'd say pretty close. I was just trying to think about how they would do it. I, I know that they did tease Gal Icarus, so I'm thinking, could they do falcon, giraffe, deer, and elephant? And then I'm thinking, what about Pegasus Megazord, though? I'm, I'm hoping they do the lion. Maybe they, we already did get the rhino and armadillo, so if they do a full Gal Icarus, I hope it doesn't cost several hundred dollars if they do all of them. Yeah, I was thinking maybe they could do the elephant and the lion together if they don't put it with the falcon and the rest of those. We'll see. That's like really good timing. So while I'm editing this video, I see that the elephant and the big lion just went up for pre-order. So that, that is happening. Direct link in the video description. And here's a future prediction. I don't know if this is happening, but again, they have the molds for all these pieces, pretty much. It's almost exactly the same as the Wild Force Megazord, or Gal King. Just a recolor and a couple of different, uh, you know, pieces here. I wouldn't be surprised if they did Gal God as well. And I'm back again. Now Gal Icarus is up for sale for pre-order, direct link in the video description. So it is the whole thing. I, I figured since we already got the Rhino, it would just be Falcon, Deer, and Giraffe. So pre-order, direct link in the video description if it's still there. Hopefully it's still there. I'm trying to get this video posted before everything sells out. If it's not evident, I'm very excited. I think I need that. And I also love this combination, very underrated. This line is really coming along now. You think they're done or you think they'll keep going? And wow, I just can't get through this video without more stuff coming out. Th this is not Gal Ranger related, but Hasbro just released the Lord Draken helmet and the Spoom Studios Red Ranger Trini and Yellow Ranger Jason 2 pack, which I think is pretty cool. For now, I think I am going to skip the Draken helmet. I did buy the figures. I like them. Here are my thoughts on this based on some comments I've seen today <laughs> so far. Okay. Yes, more Mighty Morphin. Hasbro had molds for these already, so it's easy for them to just release these things again, even though they've made some changes. So I see that these are pinless. It looks like Trini now has additional articulation in the arms. It's easy to release things they already have. I don't believe this set is coming at the expense of something else. It's not like a thing that's gonna be everywhere. It's exclusive to GameStop and limited quantities on Hasbro Pulse, which sold out very quickly. The Yellow Ranger male body gives Drew Ranger fans a chance to have a 
male yellow without buying a figure arts, you know, for the Hasbro collection. So that's cool. The Red Ranger helmet. I hope they didn't change anything with the helmets because you should just be able to take this Red Ranger helmet and give it to your existing Red Ranger and have a proper Red Ranger helmet because this helmet looks good. But I also don't think this is going to be the only way that you can get a proper Red Ranger helmet. Call me crazy, but I'm sure Hasbro would be thrilled to sell us another set of Mighty Morphin figures that are pinless, have updated helmets, maybe some new or different accessories, I don't know. That doesn't seem like it would be a bad idea given how many sets of Mighty Morphin we're gonna have. Okay, this video totally started out as a Gal Ranger slash Wild Force video. I, I've kind of drifted here, but direct links to all the stuff in this video in the video description. All right, I'm gonna end here. Thank you guys for watching. Good night.